Hey everyone, just wondering if anybody's ever felt like this before. You've had the greatest of intentions of getting up and doing everything that you're supposed to, and then you go to sleep. You, you fall asleep, everything's fine, but then an hour later, you wake up, and you can't fall back asleep. And you know that your wake up time is coming, and you don't feel great. You have a headache, you're sick, kind of like I am now, and you just can't sleep. Your mind's racing, you're wondering about what's gonna happen next, about all the things that you need to do tomorrow, the next day, the next week, the next month. You got hopes and dreams and plans that you are hoping all turn out the way that you want to. What do you do? And your mind's still racing. And then all of a sudden you realize it's 12.30. But then all of a sudden you wake up. And it's, and it's your wake up time. For me, that's 4.30. So yeah, I had five hours worth of sleep. It wasn't the greatest. And when you wake up, you have this thought. Well, you know what? I didn't sleep very well. I don't feel very good. Um, I could, you know, say to myself, you know what? Today, I don't need to go to the gym. But then you know what? You get up, just like I did. You get up and you go. And when you get to the gym, you get there and you're tired and you're thinking to yourself, well, I'm just gonna do a very simple workout. And you know what, I've done that a couple times. But then all of a sudden you realize, you know what, I'm here, let's do this. And you put in a solid amount of time at the gym and you do the weights and you, and, and you push through. And you get home and it's a win. And that's what this message is for, for all of you that are struggling about having a horrible night's sleep, feeling just the worst ever, um, and then still grinding through to get to the other side, because you know that those days, and like I used to say with my gym uh, buddy, Mark, those days are the days that define you. Those days where you had all the excuses that you give, you could give yourself and use, but don't use, and you go, those are the days that define you. Those are the days that you're gonna remember. That's the point of this video, is I know everyone is dealing with stuff like this. I deal with it all the time, and I just wanted to inspire all of you to keep going, to keep doing, to keep pushing, when those days come, because those are the days that are you're going to remember. Those are the days that are defining you today. And I'm I'm excited for what the future holds uh, for everyone that pushes through those days. And are you going to have off days? Yes. However, push through. Our excuses should not define us, but our decisions can make a huge definition of who we become because if you can push through the excuses that you give yourself and let's be honest you're the only one giving yourself those excuses nobody else is gonna hold you accountable it's you it's you versus you and so that's why it's a win because there's people that are grinding on a daily basis that are sick and still getting up and still getting after and doing what they're supposed to do and some choose not to. So today can be a defining day for you. Today can be that day where you decide, yes, tomorrow, I, regardless of what happens, I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna go do the things that are, I'm supposed to go and do. So again, just wanted to share that with you guys. It's something I experience and um, I normally would share that with my gym buddy, but he's gone. He's moved away and now sitting at the gym in the mornings, not being able to pass this on to him and have that conversation with him. I felt like I, I needed to get this out because today was one of those days. Today's, and I felt like a champ after I got back. I felt great because I won against my myself. I won against the old version of myself. And every day that I win against that old version of myself, that doubting, pessimistic, you know, negative guy, I get better. I hope that you guys and gals can sense that. This is something that's important. And again, keep at it. 